Remember, both techniques are to be used only for educational purposes. First up is Fern. In Kali Linux, you can find this by clicking on the Kali icon on the top left and typing Fern in the search field. It brings up the Fern logo, and by clicking on this, you start the application. The large green Fern logo appears, and a simple and easy to use interface appears shortly after. During pen testing, we always use word lists. These can be found in the user share word lists folder and contain many useful lists of passwords. And for example, the Rocky word list has 14 million passwords, which is insane. Now, we have to turn on the Wi-Fi monitoring in Fern. By clicking on the Select Interface drop-down, select the WLAN 0 interface. Then click on the blue Wi-Fi button and it will become active, scanning for broadcasting access points. By clicking on the WPA, we are only scanning for these specific APs, all now shown at the top of the page, with my Wi-Fi highlighted. Now we have to select the word list of passwords to attack the Wi-Fi. This is in the folder mentioned earlier, so navigate to where I am on the screen and select your preferred word list. As you get more comfortable with this process, you will create your own more targeted word list. I am using mine here called jin-password.txt. Next, we have to target a device on the network, in this case my mobile phone, from the drop-down list. By then clicking the attack button, we begin the process of de-authenticating the phone from the Wi-Fi network. On the right, you will see my phone losing its connection and trying to re-establish the connection. Firm will use the password list to check if my phone's stored password is being used to log in. The handshake process continues until the list of checks is carried out, shown here in the blue box. The password is found, shown here in red at the bottom. Thanks for joining us for the Fern section, now we are moving on to another great tool. For the second part of today's video, you will have learned the Wi-Fi technique to hack your Wi-Fi, for pen testing purposes. As usual, please note this video is for educational purposes only and should not be used in public. In a previous video, I have been using Aircrack NG to perform aero dump techniques to sniff the air, watching devices as they connect to a specific BSS ID and channel. Also, as shown, we use de-author tags to capture packets from a user as they reconnect to the Wi-Fi, a common technique with the Aircrack suite. To start Wi-Fi, you can either visit the menus at the top or just type it in the CLI. If you start from the menu, it will bring up a help menu with all of the Wi-Fi parameters. Just a few of these will be used later on in this video, such as hyphen hyphen kill, WPA and dict, which relates to a word list. There are more options here, but we are going to stick with just WPA for now. As you can see, we can type Wi-Fi in the CLI, but immediately it says that we need to be a root user to use this application. To achieve this, type in sudo su and you will become root. We can start a standard Wi-Fi scan just by issuing the command sudo Wi-Fi. This uses its preset parameters and will have a default word list to try and crack the Wi-Fi. It has picked up all of the BSS IDs on the 2 point for gig frequency. If we run a simple ifconfig command to check the interface status, we can see that the WLAN interface is in monitor mode from the previous scan. So we are going to start fresh and stop the M on NG process, then start Wi-Fi again. The wireless network has reappeared, letting us know we are good to go. This time round, with the Wi-Fi command, we are going to include some extra parameters. The hyphen hyphen WPA is for only scanning WPA wireless LANs. The hyphen hyphen dict command is to type in the path to the password word list. You can use the default here, or your own word list. The hyphen hyphen kill command is to remove any other processes that may interfere with Wi-Fi. Press enter and Wi-Fi will run the various Python scripts and capture the ESS IDs using WPA. Hit Ctrl C to then enter the ESS ID number, in this case 2, for my Wi-Fi. As I have a relatively small word list, it cracks the Wi-Fi password quickly. Wi-Fi displays it in several places. As good housekeeping, when you have finished a session of Aircrack NG or Wi-Fi, it is important to turn off the WLAN monitoring. 
Issuing the M on NG stop WLAN 0 MON command will stop the monitoring and restart the wireless adapter. However, this does not always work. So, type service network manager restart and it will bring the wireless back to life. If config shows that the WLAN 0 MON has gone and WLAN 0 is back on the network with its IP address. So, between Fern and Wi Fi, which one do you prefer? Place in the comments below. Visit the G-Man channel again soon and be sure to subscribe and like this video. Bye for now.